Hello everyone! It's great to be with you here today so I can share with you another story from the Bible. Lizzie, and this... could you teach me to make a cup of tea please? Tea bag in, boiling water in, bit of milk, drink. Great, thanks. Right, as I was saying, uh, yeah. This week's story is from the beginning of the Bible and it's all about a man named Moses. Moses was a pretty cool guy. You might have heard of him before. He is known for doing all sorts of amazing things as he faithfully followed God. Lizzie! Harry stole my favourite pen! Make him give it back! Harry! Give Tom's pen back! Give it back! Uh, where was I? Oh yeah, Moses. So, Moses rescued God's people from being slaves in Egypt. He led them right through the middle of the sea and now he was in charge as God, as the people of God travelled to the land that God had promised them. But it was hard work. Lizzie, I'm bored. Can you entertain me? Go and do a jigsaw puzzle. Oh, okay. <sighs> right, so as I was saying, it was hard work leading the people because the people disobeyed God and had lots of arguments between themselves. And every time someone had a problem or an argument, they brought it to Moses to solve. Lizzie! Josh what? is being mean to me. Please help! Oh, that is enough! Stop interrupting me and let me tell my story! You see, this is why Moses was tired. People brought their problems to him every day and he had no one to help him. And then one day, Moses' father-in-law, that is, Moses' wife's dad, came to visit. Moses' father-in-law was called Jethro, and he was very, very wise. He saw Moses surrounded by all those people, all asking for help. And Jethro asked Moses, Moses, why are you making all the decisions by yourself? Oh, said Moses, because, well, because it's, you know, they, ju they just all ask me. Well, said Jethro, that's not very smart. You can't do it all by yourself. You'll just get exhausted and then you'll be no use to everyone. You should be leading God's people, not making every decision for them. Pick some people who know God's rules. Get them to be judges and tell the people to go to them with their problems. Only if those judges can't sort it out can they then bring the questions to you. Moses, you need to stop doing it all by yourself. So, Moses did what Jethro asked him. He put together this team of judges to help him. And it all worked out just like Jethro said it would. Moses learned a very important lesson that day. He learned that working with others was what God wanted. And that lesson is just as true for you and for me. God doesn't want us to struggle with things on our own. He designed us to work with others. God wants us to work in community. People are not made to be on their own. They're designed to help each other and work together. So next time you're struggling, why don't you ask for help? I hope you've enjoyed today's story. I'll see you all next week.